Hi guys, it's me. I have a haul video here that's been sitting here a little while. Um, I've been a little busy getting my grandkids. School is almost out. Kelsey has um, like three or four more weeks and she graduates. She just found out that she is going to graduate with a 4.0. Um, I think that's summa cum laude, but it's the highest honors at her college, so that's going to be amazing. Um, I've been trying to organize a little party for her. She doesn't want it on the same day, so we're going to make it for maybe the weekend after or something like that, but yeah, she's excited to be done. <laughs> done writing papers, done taking tests. But she found out, somebody told her that the school can tell them when they can go take their state board. Um, I didn't think once you graduated, the school had any more to do with it other than getting your results. But somebody told her that they have to be on a computer for at least six hours a day doing their study guides for the state testing. And... Um, and if they're not doing that consistently for a period of time, then they won't be allowed to take, uh, get an appointment to take their test. I don't believe that. I, I just can't believe that the school can do that once you've graduated. So I told her to just do what she has to do during school and then we'll deal with what afterwards. I can't believe they can say one thing or another other than I think they want to have control over it because the test scores do, you know, the look, whether you graduate or not, whether you actually pass the test through the state, um, that would look good or bad on the school. So maybe they want to make sure that you're going to look good and they get a higher rating. I don't know. I don't know how they can do that. But this stuff is all from um, Tuesday morning. I found a couple of really cute embossing folders. This one has little balloon. There's a little balloon animal there. Just three balloons, and one of them's like one of those little animals. So I thought that was cute. These are only $1.49. And this one has the little ladybugs all over it, which I used to call Kelsey my little ladybug. So that was cute. I found these egg shaped um, cookie cutters, but they show you how you can make, make it different, you know. Those are cute. They'd be cute to make like donuts or, you know, something like that too. They had some of the glue dots. Um, I don't normally buy them like this, but these ones are the, I think the super strong, ultra thin super strength are these ones. And then these ones are removable. I got these because when I send people things like bows or things that I've made and I want to attach it to something pretty and then mail it, I want them to be able to take it up and use it, you know what I mean, without tearing anything up. So I use the removable dots for that. So that's why I got those. Oops. I found this really cool glitter mix with the stars and the red and the white and the blues. Isn't that pretty? Don't that make a really cool shaker for 4th of July? So I got that one and that's $1.99. I picked up this pack of EK Success um, journaling pens in the different size tips. I bought these for my granddaughters. Both of them have been into drawing a lot lately, so they were asking for some thin um, black pens if I could find some. I found this really cute bow bunny wood shaped 20 pieces. They're different little bird, uh, bird cages. I like to add little wood pieces every once in a while, the stuff that I make. I think that's really pretty. $2.99, super cute. They had a ton of Mickey Disney type stuff. And um, I just started working on my, uh, we went on a Disney cruise when Ben was younger um, for his Make-A-Wish. That's what he chose. He wanted to go swim with dolphins. So they sent us on a Disney cruise. And it was, I had to pay for my way, but his family's was all paid for. That was the most fun we have had. And it was so fun. Um, even, I thought being on the Disney cruise would be like not too much fun for adults, but they 
there's things for adults to do too and um it was interesting it was fun so um i got these these are called it says memories so i got two of those and then Allie loved tinkerbell so i got a couple of these Tinkerbell, and she actually dressed up like Tinkerbell, I think, in one one day. And then, um, they all loved this show. The, what was that called? N Nemo. Nemo. Um, and then I just bought this because I thought it was super cute. It's called Journaling Cards. And it, it has, this is like a, a resin piece. And it says, hello, beautiful. And then this one is just, you can add that to, and then there's this, and then the card inside. So that you could add to an album or something. It'd be super cute. And then I found this uh, graduation. We all know why I picked that up. And um, I found these. I thought my grandkids would love those and get a kick out of those. And then this big Mickey pack that has all these different characters on this one and then this one in the middle which has some layered ones in the castle and then this one says Mickey friend Mickey and friends on this and it's big it's really thick it's actually chipboard yeah and then underneath it has these ones words letters and some more super cool so I got that one and the last thing I picked up was this. Mickey letters. Too cute. So I'll find lots of spaces to use some of those. The last couple things I picked up were they had some dyes. I really liked this. It's a woman's fan and gloves. Wouldn't this be pretty on stuff? And then I found the hat. So, remind me of Easter, you know, or real pretty Victorian. And then the shoe. Isn't that a cool? So, I picked up those three. And the last thing I got was this pad of paper. Because I don't need any paper. But I really like this. I have always liked it from the very beginning when I first saw it. But... I just couldn't do it. But I broke down and bought it. Because it's so pretty. <laughs> I'm just going to do this. And these are real pretty, like glittered. This is just real gold. Like gold dots. Peach colored roses or flowers. Some cut aparts. Super cute, right? That one. It's getting harder to do. That was the green page. Ooh, look at that one. That one's really pretty. And there's just some plain yellow. And some stripes. Oops. This is like that other one, only this is real glittery and like enamel almost. Real thick. Those two. Real, but it, the glitter doesn't rub off. That one. I don't know if you guys all needed to see every single page, but I'm not good at flip throughs. Not. They have some just plain pages every once in a while, like peach or yellow, or there was a green one. Just plain paper, nothing. You know, special. I'm almost there. Ooh, look at that. That's bright and shiny. And the last page is this one. 
which is so pretty. So that's my haul. Um, I'd also like to remind you that I do still have my um, challenge going on. It's for my birthday, which is in April. I'm going to go ahead and extend the date to the end of May. And um, I'm hoping more people will join. I've only gotten one entry so far. And I, it's for, um, you know, the banner pieces that are hang that I have hanging up here. And then the ones right there that I just got. And that's where I'm going to hang them across there. So I'm real excited. I hope some more people will join in. And I can have a whole row of them to look at. I love it looking at everybody else's um, work. So I feel like. A lot of people have kind of fallen off by the wayside. I haven't seen them or seen them really on much. Or since all that stuff with Brittany and Crystal happened, I feel like the group that I talked to the most um, kind of all disappeared. You know what I mean? I miss Dana and um, Live to Learn Dana. I really liked her. Talking to her, I haven't seen her on much at all. Um, there's a couple other people. I can't think of their names right now, but just all that drama made it ugly. So I hope to get some more friends and, uh, we can keep talking and keep doing what we do and hopefully we can do some more fun swaps and things. So it's good talking to you guys. Um, I miss y'all. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.